So, hi everyone, uh, welcome to the SF Beer Show. Uh, I'm Adrian. I'm Valentin. So, we got a special night today. Uh, we are in France and uh, we have a special selection by uh, Valentin. So, uh, it's going to be something. Yeah, um, today we have uh, three beers. So, the first one is uh, Cuvée d'Oscar. The second one is uh, Ananas de Quai. And the third is um, Ambas. Ambas. So. Ambas. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, so uh, moving on to the first one, Cuvée d'Oscar. So, Cuvée d'Oscar is um, a beer from uh, Belgium made by a Scottish guy. So, uh, Craig Allen, he made also another beer, it's uh, Agent Provocateur. Which is very good. Which, which you can find at La Capsule, our favorite bar in, in Lille. So, that's it. Cuvée d'Oscar. So mine looks very foamy, but yeah, it's fine. So the color is quite great. <laughs> yes, you know, it's um, a copper color. Amazing, amazing color. Quite fine. And high carbonation. Yeah. Very, you can you can just see it. And um, so what what do you smell? You know, it's um, flowers or something like that. Or the smell the forest or. <laughs> No, not the forest. The mushroom. Not, not the deeply forest. The mushroom. Not mushroom. Yeah. You know, it's um, spring. Yeah, spring flowers. And hops, of course. So. Yeah, I smell a lot of hops. Very uh, interesting. So let's give it a try. Yeah. Wow, that's a very good mix. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you, you feel the hops. Yeah. Um, it's quite smooth, you know. They yeah, very smooth. And, and so what, what kind of beer is that, officially? Because we have some issues with how to, how to categorize beers. Is, yeah. it, is it written like, is it like a, a wheat beer? Yeah. Officially? But it's not wheat, it's like, it's not white. Of so that's that's kind of a, that's the little issue we don't we don't know what it is, but, but that's, yeah. that's the whole point I think. It's <laughs> it's just amazing for me, you know. It's quite just a good beer, you know. The um, the the, um, the taste is fine. The the core is also fine. So you know, I don't have any word for for explain this beer. So it's it just speaks for itself. You yeah. Know, it's, And the temperature is perfect for the beer, yeah. You feel the hops on the first date and on the second it's also hops but very strange, you know. You you feel the um, the flowers. On the aftertaste? Yeah. You you okay. Um, how much would you rate it? For me it's um, it's a seven. It's a seven. Um, yeah. I would say seven as well. I think. Okay. <laughs> so. Okay. So yeah, moving on to the next one. Yep. Um, go ahead. So second one, anestete, anesteke, anesteke, anesteke. It means. Which um, means you can say it in French. It's fine. It means. Um, oh my God! It's very. It's super dark. Like, bye. It means bye and see you. See you later in in the north. French language, so. In the style, or in the no, Flemish, Flemish, Flemish. So some of you might know what it means. So and this beer, it's um, imperial smooth. Smooth, smoke, S smooth, smooth. No, smooth. You, we cannot say smooth. Smooth. Sorry, it's it's not Americanized yet. Yeah. It's not stout. Smooth, smoke. Smooth. 
Smooth, okay. Smooth. Okay. So not start, but sm smooth. <laughs> okay, anyway. So we got something very dark. Very. Yeah, like. Um, completely. Like an imperial yeah. stout. Opaque. Um, you cannot see anything through it's it. It's very dark. No light can go through it. And as you can see, the, the head is um, not white, so it's a little bit brown. <laughs> and. Yeah. Little. Little head. You, you 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 smell it. It's um, you smell a lot of character in this in that one. It's like <laughs> like a, um, because I ever taste this beer with a friend and he said you know it's like banana. <laughs> oh yeah, he told me it's like banana and some ca some caramel. So yeah, in interesting mix, I guess. Uh, okay. Really great. It's amazing. It's amazing. That's a very good pick. So it's um, it's a beer from um, Brasserie uh, du Pays Flamand. It's a um, it's a French brewery. So um, it's a great brewery. You know they they make also some other beer like uh, Brassine and uh, Anastake Blonde, and it's also just. Good beer, very, ta and, very tasty. Like, and this beer was um, an experimentation for uh, Christmas. It's um, at the beginning, it was just a, a Christmas beer. So, but <laughs> but it became successful, I yeah. guess, with, with the. <laughs> That's cool. So, how how do we find out about all these beers? Like we we have some stores in the U.S. but um, it's, it's not in like that. I I guess like I, I saw your collection. Yeah, the, the this beer I found on the on the on the brewery directly. Di so directly on site. Yeah, that's good. And the um, the guy made made a, just a presentation and said, you know, you you must try it. You must try it it's because it's just amazing. And I, I guess I think it's right. It's totally right. Like uh, it's really fine. The the taste is very strange because you don't have the hops. You just have the the smell and um, the taste of yeah. You do like roast, banana roasted and bananas and caramel. Caramel. Yeah, very very special and interesting taste. Okay, but I like it. I really yeah. like it. So I would give it a nine. Uh, yeah, I uh, I just give it a, a eight because um, because you have some reason. Yeah, you have some, some reason, and it's not it's good, but <laughs> I know the other beer from the brewery, and <laughs> it's not maybe the best, but almost. It's not the best batch, like okay. So sounds good to me. Um, Next one. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, you uh, yeah you are taking care of it. It's so, a, the next one is a... It's a special one. So let, Ambrose. I just let you introduce Ambrose. it. Um, Ambrose. Which means... To kiss. <sighs> yeah, maybe. But, you know. So this beer... Um, this beer is kissing you actually. So it's from uh, the Coaster von Okenart. So it's a Belgian beer. <laughs> and uh, this is the only Belgian. And this beer was um, the best beer from the last uh, Zitos festival. The Zitos is the biggest festival in Belgium and maybe on the world also. In the world? I yeah. Mean, so... Okay. Just see and... So yeah, we know the Zitos festival, which is which is something. Already the, the foam has an amazing taste. Like I, by mistake, I just put my nose in it. Maybe it's a. Uh, 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 how strong is it? Like I want because it smells a lot of alcohol. Like yeah, but not so strong. Maybe um, 12? not twelve. Maybe nine percent. Okay, 
It's not so strong, but not bad. Yeah, because you have to know that this beer was on the um, on the whiskey barrel. Oh yeah, that's why I can I can. So it's it. also the reason of the of the color because normally it's uh, it's a blonde beer, mm -hmm. and actually we have um, quite a brown beer. Yeah, but that's what we have now. It's like a very and very dark one. The the head is persistent and very compact. The smell it's uh, I smell like yeah the, like the bourbon barrel like it's it has been aged in that kind of yeah so just taste it yeah <laughs> cannot wait <sighs> what do you think about it? That's very strong character. Like yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just very yeah. constant. Like uh, like in the mouth, it feels like some very thick in the mouth, and then on the aftertaste, you have the full flavor of the whiskey bear. Like I can really feel it, and uh, it's great. Yeah, it's a uh, it's persistent. Uh, yeah, like from the beginning to the aftertaste. Yeah, it's a uh, it's very con very persist persistent, and. Uh, I like it. Yeah. So it, was it the first time you got it? No. No, no, it's not the first time because it's the, my first time. Yeah. The the first time I tried it, it was on the um, Brooks Festival, and I just saw that it was the beer for the Zitos um, 2011. So I said, it's just a great beer, and the bro, it's just also amazing. And, and by the way, when is Zitos 2012? When is happening? When? When they will when, go with the beer? Uh, when is the next Zitos edition? Basically? The next Zitos edition is also in Belgium, so in three weeks. Three weeks from now, like in, in yeah, yeah, April? Yeah, at, at the end of April, the last wow. weekend. And it's uh, near to uh, Brussels. It's uh, Louvain. Easy. Yeah, Louvain. Just, just take the plane to Brussels, you, you have yeah. to. It's, uh, and you have more than uh, 300 beers, so... Beers or brewer? Beers. Beers. And more than uh, 60 brewers. <laughs> so it will be yeah. just amazing. <laughs> An amazing weekend. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's, that's great. So let me try it again. For me, you know, I don't have any word because it's very strange. You know, the mm. character of the beer, it's... Maybe the reason it's the... Um, the barrel, the whiskey barrel. Yeah, I, I think it does everything in, in this case. So, <coughs> hmm. very specific, yeah, but I, I like the. And you know, so based more when when you when you smell it, it's you feel it's very strong, but mm -hmm. when you have the um, the beer on your mouth. It's not so strong, you know, it's very yeah. smooth at the beginning. And you have, at the end, the taste that you smelled. It's just amazing. The character of this beer is very amazing. <laughs> yeah. So... Yeah, for me, I would put it like a 9+. plus. 9+. plus. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm just um, I'm taking yeah. some risks tonight, but it's, yeah. uh, it's what I think. Yeah, for me, it's also a 9, because it's... It's an amazing beer. Not nine plus. No, not nine plus. Because for me, it's very difficult to, to give it this. <laughs> I think we would never get a ten. Like, <laughs> don't, don't don't expect that. It's, it's yeah. possible. But yeah, uh, excellent pick, and and I thank you for that. It's 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 great. You're welcome. <laughs> so yeah, check out the Zitos Festival uh, at the end of the of the month. Yeah, you will be here for Yeah, of course. <laughs> no, probably for sure. Yeah, for sure. I know. Um, yeah, I th I think that was it for today. Uh, do you have any yep. anything else to uh, <laughs> to add? Uh, all right. So thank thank you for watching, and uh, so I will see you next week with uh, with Taylor in San Francisco. Um, all right. See you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. <laughs>